Hi everybody, Bean Meister 22 here. Hey, let me learn you something about Hawaii. Yeah, that's right. I said I'm going to learn you. I'm going to school you something about Hawaii. You may not know this about Hawaii, but there are mongoose everywhere. Is it mongoose or mongooses? The first time I saw a mongoose on Oahu, I was driving up by the North Shore and in the road in front of me, zoom, this weaselly looking thing ran across the road. What the heck is that? And then the very next day, I'm at Hamana Bay, and I'm sitting there in the parking lot unloading a car, and there's another one. There's a whole bunch of them zooming in out of the tall grass. And once again, I said, what the heck is that? The one thing about a mongoose is they are fast, so it's hard to get the camera out and, you know, film them unless you already have the camera ready to go. And then the third time I saw a mongoose on Oahu, and really, this was the time that said, hey, you better figure out what these weaselly-looking things are. Once again, I was at Humana Bay, and we are down there on the beach getting ready to go in the water, and I saw one zoom across the sand. And then another, and then another. So I saw over a period of maybe an hour and a half, four or five of these brown, long, weaselly things running across the sand. And I said, what the heck is that? So when I got back to my hotel room, I looked it up on the internet, and I said, oh, that's what it is. It's a mongoose. And then I just happened to be clicking through the channels there in the hotel on the TV. I don't watch TV, you guys know that. But anyways, they had one of those public information commercials about not leaving food in your golf cart because the mongoose will come and get it. And I'm thinking, wow, I'd never even heard of this. And it was a really cool commercial because they showed the golf course, and they showed the golf cart, and they parked it, and then they went out to do some golfing, and it shows a mongoose zoom up to it and crawl up on there and grab his sandwich, and the mongoose is running away, and they got good video of this. And as that one mongoose is running away, carrying a sandwich, there was another mongoose passed by him, heading there to see if there's anything else to steal. And the moral of that PSA was, don't leave food unattended in your golf cart, because the weasels, the mongoose, will get it. It's their weasel. They look like weasels. They look like ferrets, really. But before you get concerned about it, they are supposed to be there. Well, they're not natural to Hawaii. They were introduced there to help get rid of rats from the sugarcane fields back a long time ago, like in 1883 or something way back then. And I guess that was a common practice on a lot of islands. They did that in Cuba and Jamaica and a lot of other places to keep the rats out of the sugarcane fields. These days, I don't know how many rats are still in the sugarcane fields, but they also eat bugs and other weird things. So it's good. They'll eat spiders and bugs and keep Hawaii bug-free and hopefully rat-free, too. So next time you're in Hawaii and you see this brown, weaselly-looking thing shoot across the street, you don't have to say, what the heck is that? You can say, oh, that's a mongoose. I know that. All right, so leave your comments in the comments section. Hope you learned something today. And hey, as always, thanks for watching. Got three. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh. It's so much. It makes me want to throw up. Oh. Beanmeister 22, the most dangerous man on YouTube.